you know, if you online sing along to those songs with us, you will have picked up as we did on the words of that last song, rejected and alone. That so describes Jesus. And you know, his heart is with so many people in the world at the moment who are rejected and alone. And as we pray this morning, if you feel rejected, if you feel alone, please tell him about it. Because our broadcast, our online service, goes to so many areas in the world. There will be some in refugee camps who certainly feel rejected. There will be some sort of abused people, men, women and children who feel alone. As we press the pause button on the devices, or even here in the building, if you know somebody who is just rejected, who is who feels completely alone, that's a good time to bring them to the Lord. So let's pray. Our loving Lord Jesus, you did indeed take the fall. You were crucified for me and for every one of us. And some of us who perhaps are here and even in the building, but certainly online, feel rejected and feel alone. You know exactly how they feel. Exactly. And you're the only one who can know exactly how they feel. As we press the pause button on the devices this morning, thank you that your ear will be bent to people bringing their need, their heartache, their loneliness to you. Thank you that your heart will be open to what's on their heart. Thank you, most amazing Jesus, that you will not only listen but you have the answers. So we press those buttons now. As we go on in prayer, Lord Jesus, we thank you that in taking the fall, you took care of rejection. Yes. You took care of aloneness. You defeated death with your own death. You defeated loneliness. You have health and completeness and comfort for everybody who comes to you. Thank you for all that you have. Thank you that 
Nobody who comes to you can ever be disappointed in what you have. Thank you that everybody who comes to you looking for a friend will find a friend. Above all, everybody who comes to you looking for a saviour will find a saviour. Whatever part of the world we're in, whatever our circumstances, you're there, you're here, and you have the answers. Lord, we lift ourselves to you and we thank you for the joy and the victory you have for us. Lead us now as we continue to worship you, learning more about how to live for you, learning more about how to draw close to you, because they are such worthwhile things to learn.